this is a seminal moment, isn't it, for House of Cards, for Netflix to be on the Emmy red carpet. How how significant is it? You've talked a lot about the, the importance of this show and, and how people are seeing it. How important is this moment? Well, there's a whole number of things that I feel. A, uh, I'm incredibly pleased for uh, Lord Dobbs, uh, who wrote the original book. Uh, I'm very pleased that, that uh, the, the British uh, have embraced the show uh, because, you know, the, the original series was brilliant and Ian Richardson was fantastic. Very beloved show. So, you know, if we hadn't gotten it right, they would have let us know, our British friends. Um, and for us to be included in the Emmys uh, as really the new kids on the block, um, it's fantastic. No matter how it goes tonight, there's a lot to celebrate. But I do think it's valuable to, to say that the Academy has proved that it's quite modern and progressive in ways that maybe people thought they wouldn't be. And that audiences are digging being in control and being able to decide how they watch something and whether they're going to binge on it or whether they're going to treat it like a novel and put it down when they want to put it down, pick it up when they want to pick it up. And it clearly works for DC as it worked for the House of Commons. It, what sort of response have you had to how you're portraying American politics for its, its good and bad? Well, I, I, I've heard a number of things. I, I, I've talked to politicians who say that they don't think any show has ever gotten it quite as right as we've gotten it. I've talked to others who think that it's, it's really uh, morally corrupt and it's not the way it really is. Um, I, I think it might be, you know, it's interesting to, to have a, an audience looking, as I say, at a, at a fictional Congress that, that works. Um, it must be fictional, I guess. Do you think you've changed, this is changing TV forever? What, you, what, you, what Netflix is doing, is it, is it that big a moment, do you think, for TV? I, I think that what is clear to me is that more platforms are going to start to emerge, m more audiences are going to start to evolve, and if networks don't follow the audience, they're, they're going to lose them, because the audiences will go where the content is. Uh, and they want it how they want it, when they want it, in the form they want it in, at a reasonable price, and they'll more than likely not steal it, they'll buy it. So maybe in some ways we've been able to learn the lesson the music industry didn't learn.